Oh, that. Wee, look at that. Look at the bottom. Not capitulating under the juice. <laughs> you little thrust. Huh? You little little shaft free house. <laughs> Your flights are undone. Are they? <laughs> are you filming? Yeah. yeah. Hello everyone. <laughs> Move my tackle away. <laughs> Welcome back to Food Review Club. I hope you guys are all doing great. I am just the other side of Hoxton Square now. I think it was Hoxton Market. I was laughing mm. at shaft free house. <laughs> hey, yay! Up the shaft. So, before we crack on, this video is brought to you by Holy Sweets. There's the logo down there. If you like your pick and mix, one kg bags of sweets, Sealy Tops, the sickest mix in the planet. Mixed jellies, fizzies, and they even do a car pack to travel around with in your motor, boiled sweets, humbugs, toffee apples, all that sort of jazz and stuff. If you use the code FRC10, I'll put the website here, you can get yourself a little FRC family discount. Now, where am I and what am I chuffing eating? Meat liquor. I've had loads about this place, Jess. Um, we've, have we, I would like to speak on both. Uh, I'd like to speak on behalf of both of us. I don't know if you've never been here before. No. I've never been here either. So here we are. Meat liquor, Shaftesbury House. Oh yeah. First impressions when I walked in. Obviously, it's, it's takeaway only. Walked in, made the order. Looks wicked inside. Really dark and moody. Loads of like um, pictures on the wall of people's uh, in suits with like goat goat head skulls. Freak you! If you're on a trip, that'd be the worst place to go in your life. <laughs> so hopefully the food will be good. Now, Jess, we've got a burger, a chicken side, fries, and a milkshake. Thirty odd quid. Oh yeah. Are you doing, mate? Yeah, I'm good. What's thirty odd quid? This, this from meat liquor. Meet your car. That one. Have you, have you ever been there? No. What is it? Uh, like burgers and stuff. Burgers. Chips, chicken. Nice. Chicken. What, what's your name? Is it vegan? Louis. Louis, have you got anything to say to the world? I love the world. It's great. You love the world. <laughs> need more burgers. <laughs> need more burgers. I love the world. It's great. We need more burgers. My man, that was Louis. Thanks. Welcome to the page, Louis. What a legend. What a legend. Do you remember Trevor from... Um, the, the hackney, the shortage of that. What did he say? The lockdown. Lockdown, fuck it. Lockdown, fuck it. All right, cool. So, I've heard big things about this, haven't we, Jess? Like, we get so many recommendations on videos, as you guys know. I'm sure you're watching this now and you think you might know somewhere. Meat liquor pops up time and time again. So, I'm really excited by this one, Jessica. Ooh. Don't know what that is. Feels like some oh, kind of container. He put us some ketchup and mayo in, I think. Did he? No, Jess, that is the ketchup and mayo. <laughs> What's the secret stuff? I don't know. I don't know. So, chips. Now, look at this branding on point here, look. Look at this. Branding on point. They've even got something for the back of house kitchen stuff to tick off what they've got. Now, Jess, interesting for you guys to know, we went for the Ooh. classic. We went for the classic. One that everyone gets. It's called the Dead Hippie. Um, you'll see. I think you should do burger first because people have been complaining, saying you're doing the burger too late and then it goes soggy. Fair enough, people. I'm a, I'm a man of the people. <laughs> you talk. Yeah, okay, look. Ah. It's not going to go that soggy. Look, mm -hmm. literally just walked out the door of it. Keep your knickers on, Paul. <laughs> Paul, sitting at home in your Star Wars pyjamas, f***ing off into a sock in your mum's house. Stop. That's enough from you, young man. All right, cool, let's have it. Oh, look at that. See what I mean? Funky, funky. <laughs> Meat liquor. So, this burger is called the Dead Hippie. Essentially, it's the classic. It is the classic. Cheeseburger. You'll see, my love. Oh, look at this, look. Great folding. You see that, how they folded it up? Little things. Yeah, it really is. There we have it. First impression, kind of small. Kind of small, but kind of compact. Oh, that, wee, look at that. Look at the bottom. Not capitulating under the juice. Look at the top. High, isn't it? 
you know what? I've had enough of talking. I'm going to start eating. Lucky, yeah, it's only fun. If you're new to the page, <laughs> welcome to Food Review Club. <laughs> Big pickles. Yeah, and the burger's not bad either. There we have it, look. Let's dive in. Pickle first. Oh, yoik. That is a terrific burger. I don't know how to explain this. Super meaty. Fresh, great salad. Pickle was fucking strong. Really like gnarly crunch to it. The burger, the actual meat itself. Look at that, look. There we go, look at that. Shredded lettuce. Let's get some of this meat. Good packaging. Slightly pink on the middle. Great. Bit of caramelization on the outside. I've had so many different burgers. It has its own unique flavour. All these different cuts of beef, don't they? And different ways. The way, of they, the way they mince, mince it. Mince it and. The seasoning. That is tasty AF. That's short for as fuck. If you're thinking about a cheeseburger in your head, the classic, that hits the spot. Got a really simple seed, not seedless bun. It's just super soft, but still has that purchase to it. Look at the base underneath. No, not soggy, not a mess. Fit for purpose. So many of these great places have buns. Well, we like to call them on the page, shuns. Good start. Now, drink watch. Chocolate milkshake, 4.95. Oi. Can't remember how much that was, by the way, but I remember looking at that. You know, that's okay if it's a big one, it comes out like that. This is like literally the small cup from Wimpy. Yeah, the straw, does, look, straws, this straw's more out of it than in it. doesn't taste super high like fancy fancy but it just tastes kind of what you want like it tastes like really good kind of got like an ice cream uh like an ice cream texture to it mm. running through it super cold the chocolate's not too overpowering it's nice just like sits well on your tongue it's not too haven't got the sauces the fuggy bits in there the lumps the chunks I think I know where this is going. Right, Jess. What have you got there? What sauces does this come with? What is it? It's a chicken, I, I believe. Ooh, that looks nice. What is that? I like it. That's the sauce that they come with the, the, these chicken bites. Okay. The monkey fingers. Monkey fingers. Here we go. Ready? Oh. So that is oh, a portion. I, I was expecting. That is a portion of monkey fingers. How cool are they? They look like little bits of cod. Like cod batter, isn't it? Beer batter. Look at that, look. No, look at, the, look at the look at the aeration in that batter though. What a wicked idea. So Jess. Dunk it in that, that red sauce. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Buffalo sauce. Uh, <coughs> blue cheese and buffalo. Oh yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Here we go then. Monkey fingers. Do I go go into the cheese as well, do you reckon? Yeah, I'm gonna do. Gonna double, double dip. Don't look. Double dip. There we go. Monkey finger. Let's go. Love it. Yeah. Yeah. I've got a yummy piece of chicken in there which you get a great piece of moisture from tiny bit of chicken by the way 
Yeah, it's got this gnarly, deep, crispy um, batter around the outside. That really is a tiny bit of chicken. <laughs> it might just be that one. Mm. With your buffalo and blue cheese sauce. What an amazing idea. Make my mouth water. <laughs> <clears throat> also, look. Ooh. It might only be a small piece of chicken, but look how many you get. Yeah, you get loads. It's not like you're been held back on by a portion size there, are you? That looks like a big bit of chicken. There we go, people. Side watch, monkey fingers. Very rarely will you see them in that type of batter. Meat liquor, love the inventiveness. Yeah. I see you. Like Avatar, I see you. Really enjoying this, really, really enjoying this. Meat liquor, fantastic. And the best thing is, I know there's 10 other things on the menu that I would have enjoyed equally. One of those types of, types of menus. Full chicken selection. Full burger selection. Sorry, chicken burger selection. Hamburgers, chicken burgers, salt and pepper fries. Oh yeah. Ooh. Do you know what though? These Billy Basic fries like this. They've lost all their crunch whatsoever. Oh. But, This is the type of fry that you want to eat with a burger sometimes. It's like Mackey's fry, isn't it? Yeah, you know, correct. Like actual fry. Do you know what, Jess? You've hit the nail on the point there. You hit the nail on the head, sorry. <laughs> Fries like this sometimes just go with a shake, a burger, mayo and ketchup. Like I, I can see this video ending now and you and me just like destroying this. <laughs> um, really, really cool. Meat Lick, I'm so glad we came. All right, cool. Let's wrap it up. Meat liquor. I get it. You're cool. You're trendy. You're fashionable. You're in a cool part of town. You're cooking great food. I understand why your prices are where they are. And do you know what? I respect it. It's good food. It's clean, you know who you are. The food does too. Those monkey fingers are an absolute result. The one reservation is that I had a bigger milkshake. I feel like for a fiver, that's probably something that you can give a little bit to the customers. Give them a whopping great big milkshake. And it probably would spin my head from the whole thing. I feel like I've been done over there a little bit of that for a fiver. And I'm going to cling on to it. <laughs> the burger was outrageous. Good portion. Um, I don't think I could have more than that. You know, sometimes you get a big one, and a really big burger, and it looks grand, but you couldn't eat it anyway. Great size. The monkey fingers with the buffalo sauce and the blue cheese. Fantastic chips. On point. I've been to a few burger places in London, and I think they're the elite of the elite. This for me is not on that caliber of, I always say that, it's not on that caliber, like it's way less, it's not. It's right up there, but it's just missing something for me in terms of magic. However, for me, this nails, nails it on the munch meter. The munch meter here is going like this, off the charts. I wanna give this a score today, and I'm gonna be generous with it too. I'm gonna give this a, an 8.75. What? You're gonna double, double point? An 8.75. Not quite an 8.8. .8, but I feel an 8.75 uh, 8 is a fantastic score. That's really done me. I think that's annoying me a little bit. <laughs> We've paid really good money for the rest of the food. Portion size, poor. The rest of it, fantastic. And I've enjoyed it. I've had a smile on my face. Good food, meat liquor. Thanks for having us. Appreciate you watching, guys. If you're new to the page, remember to give us a like, give us a share, get in the comments if you can. If you're watching on YouTube, please hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. It would mean the world to me. Thanks for watching everyone. And that is a review.